Hey y'all, Irix Guy here, and uh, this is still another video I filmed first day in the field with the DJI Mini 2, and I'll have to say so far, and again, at the time of filming this, I haven't looked at any of this video that's been downloaded, I haven't looked at the edited product that you're watching, but I can tell you just from a, from a uh, ease of use perspective, everything's been flawless. All that I did before I went to the field today is charge the remote, charge the DJI Mini 2, and uh, update the firmware, that's all I did. So in the field, fired everything up no hiccups check out my uh, DJI Mini 2 first flight video see for yourself how smoothly everything's gone I will go as far as to say and part of this is probably experience because I've been using drones since Phantom 1 but even with that being the case there's been previous drones where I've gotten in the field and I've had hiccups so far there have been zero zero hiccups that I've seen now again once I download this footage and when you're watching it you may observe some things that I didn't see while I was in the field but from what I've seen in the field, everything's been great. And I've flown the exhaustive first flight video, the DJI Mini first flight, very long video. I filmed a, uh, a, a quick shot modes video, check that one out. Uh, the quick shot modes were, uh, um, it, was kind of, it was kind of cut short because I got a phone call and I did a few of the modes, but then I got a phone call and it stopped my screen recording, which is something I use to record what you can see it, you know when you're watching my videos so i i just did a few of the quick shot modes i'll be doing a follow-up video capturing more of those quick shot modes for you um the uh uh this video is just kind of my well it is my third video for the first day in the field or at least the first morning in the field right now it's about uh it's about 10 10 13 a.m new york city time so you know this is just uh just something that i wanted to I uh, wanted to film because I got 32% battery life remaining. Why not? I mean, y'all are looking for, you're watching this video, man. You know, you're, you're obviously searching for DJI Mini 2 videos, and I want to show y'all the, the truth. You know, I don't, I don't sugarcoat stuff. You know, I'm out here having a good time. But, you know, this is the production version of the DJI Mini 2. And, you know, I, I purchased it. This is not some sort of pre-release. Oh, we're going to send you this for a review. No, nah, no, nah, that, that doesn't work. You know the videos I'm talking about. No bad blood towards those people. But, you know, if you want an honest review of the actual drone, the drone that you would purchase, and, and if you do purchase it, go please go to epicdroneshow.com. I'd really appreciate that. But without further ado, let's go ahead and take this sucker airborne again. Let's hit record. Oops. I got to go back to video mode. I did a still photo, so I'm going to go to video mode. And we're going to do... 4k here so this is 4k recording just going to get some footage do some uh do some different different types of shots so we're going to do this right now we're going to kind of come close to me look at the detail there kind of go close to the car over here look at the car detail it's dirty man i took that thing all the way to all over Timbuktu. I gotta clean it. But, uh, yeah, so let's do some low to the ground stuff here. Kind of do some cool little angles. I am in, I am in, uh, normal mode. So, you know, I'm not in, uh, not in, they don't call it tripod mode anymore. They call it cine or sign mode, cinema mode. So that's, that's kind of a rebranding on the controller. See, you can see right here on the controller, it says sign, C-I-N-E, and I'm in normal. It's also got sport. Now, obviously, we will be doing reviews of all the modes. Again, this is just my first morning in the field, so I'm gonna have to recharge my battery and, and get, uh, you know, get those other those other flights. I mean, if you've, if you've been a subscriber of my channel for a while, you know that I don't just do one video and throw in the towel. I've got thousands of drone videos. So subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and ring that bell icon and you can watch all of them. But, you know, part of what I like about this is, you know, I know that when I'm researching a product, you know, whether it's a drone or a camera or whatever, that I go out and find the people that you know, they're not these doctored up videos that are professionally edited and all that. I'm not saying you don't, I'm not saying I frown upon people that take time and produce a video that is, 
that is visually pleasing. I'm not saying that by any means. But what I'm saying is, is you know, those types of presentations where they're so fine-tuned, where they're so professional, that you cannot believe the content within. So, you know, it's my hope that, you know, when you're watching this, that you're seeing, that you're seeing good video quality. You know, that, that everything seems to be, um, you know, beyond acceptable quality. You know, that's my goal. Uh, what you're not gonna get here is any sort of flashy effects and, and graphics and, and stuff that makes it, in my opinion, less than believable. And I know, I mean, I know there's, there's YouTubers out there that have huge marketing budgets and they've probably farmed out a lot of their editing tasks and they've probably farmed out a lot of their, uh, even their, even their review task. You know, they probably farmed a lot, that's the low battery warning. They probably farmed a lot of that out, which is fine. I mean, if you've got the budget and you want to do that, you know, at that point, you know, your your YouTube, um, I'm going to hit cancel because I'm low to the ground. If it falls to the ground, so be it. Um, but, uh, yeah, the people that can do that, that's fine. I mean, personally, I think that it takes a little bit of thrill out of, uh, out of running the YouTube business. You know, I think, you know, if you're, if you're farming everything out, you know, you're not as hands-on, you know, at that point, you know, your role has become more political and more managerial. And, you know, if you're like me, you probably, you probably don't find as much fun in that. You know, I, I'm having a good time doing this and I'm going to have a good time when I go back and, <coughs> excuse me, edit this video and produce the product that you're watching right now. You know, this, this review video. So, you know, again, I don't have any bad blood towards the YouTubers that, that go the pre-release route, the YouTubers that farm out their editing, that farm out their flight tests. All power to them if that's how they want to do it. I mean, if, if, they, only, if they only want to cheat, treat YouTube as a business, that's fine. But, you know, there should, in my opinion, there should be that, that rewarding, that feeling of reward. And that's, you know, that's what I've got here. I mean, I've got, you know, truth be told, and we're 14% battery life remaining. But uh, one of my viewers during the live show said, hey man, are you getting the, the DJI Mini 2? And I'm like, the DJI Mini 2, you know, what is, and I didn't even realize it had released, but apparently when I did a live show, um, you know, right around that same time, DJI was unveiling this drone. Uh, fortunately, you know, because of my, my live, uh, live show viewer that, that had commented, and said, hey man, are you getting the DJI Mini 2? Look at how precise this thing is, man. Watch this. Right on the H. So I'm gonna stop the recording there. Um, but yeah, the viewer that said, are you getting the DJI Mini 2? I was like, yeah. He's like, well, it just released. And I said, okay, well, you know, I had to get on the ball. Got this as, you know, ordered and shipped as quickly as I could. And, and again, if you're looking for this, expand this video's description and then click the link there or just go to epicdroneshow.com and then click buy a drone you can find i just got the basic you know the base one i didn't get the fly more with the extra batteries and the extra stuff um but this battery and i'm still showing 11 percent this battery life is phenomenal now again i've done all my flying today first morning in the field with the dji mini 2 i've done all my flying with the uh you know, just one battery. And I've been able to do my, my first field test of the DJI Mini 1, very, very lengthy video. I did the next video, which was quick shot modes, which kind of got cut short because I had a, had a little screen recording app that I use, but I got a phone call and it crashed the screen recording app. So I didn't want to continue with the quick shot modes because that's, you know, you're not getting to see the in-app view. And then I did this video Flew her down to 11% battery life remaining, and it's just, it's, uh, let's see if it's warm. It's, I mean, it's got a little bit of warmth to it. Temperature out here is probably in the, in the low 60s Fahrenheit, but this, you know, some of the other drones, you touch them and they're and they're uh, noticeably warm to the touch. This this doesn't have that uh, uh, doesn't have that feel, and that's kind of cool. And you can see the the design here. It's kind of it's got vents. I mean, it 
I think they've they've put they've put a lot of thought into the thermals of the uh, of the and I keep wanting to say Mavic, but it's not a Mavic. It's the DJI Mini Two. So just a uh, just a really impressive first morning in the field with this. And again, I have I have not I have not watched this video yet. I've only filmed. I've flown, and I've you know I've looked at the in-app view, and I can tell you everything that I've seen. Um, you know, without looking at the edited footage, without looking at the footage that's been downloaded from the uh, from the Mini 2, I mean, this thing is this thing has potential. So I'm excited to hear your feedback after you've watched this video, and let me know what you think about the DJI Mini 2. Now, again, this is just this is my third video, so I'm going to be posting a ton of videos. So subscribe to youtubecom forward slash guy ring that bell icon and what that does is notifies you whenever i post another video and i've got a video playlist entitled uh, dji mini 2 and that's where i'm gonna be posting all my dji mini 2 videos so i've got a lot of things that you know just like i've done with previous drones you know a sequence of of videos that i like to to film you know the first flight that's an important one but also the follow-up flights and then you know problems have i encountered issues so far i haven't but if i do what was the issue? How did I fix it? And, you know, what are your questions? And what are my responses to your questions? You know, ask away. That's what that comment section down there is, you know, below this video or beside this video, wherever, is for, is for you to ask the questions. Tune into my live shows, Epic Drone Show, and, you know, ask in real time. Hey, want to be a guest? Shoot me a message and I'll see if I can get you on uh, face on video. But, I mean, this is, this is big stuff. I mean, this is small... This is a small product, but it is it is big future. I mean, I'm putting it in a in this jacket pocket, man. Well, I, oh, I got zipper on there. I don't want to scratch it. Yeah, that's a rough zipper. I got this when I went heli skiing. Um, but uh, yeah, man. I mean, tell me what you think. I mean, I, I could ramble on and on. Tell me what you think. And again, be sure to subscribe YouTube.com forward slash irix guy y'all have a good day fly safely and be a drone evangelist you know preach safe and responsible drone use because if you don't this hobby is not going to be around that much longer y'all have a good day hey y'all captain irix guy here i hope y'all enjoyed this video if you did please be sure to subscribe it's youtube.com forward slash irix guy and ring that bell icon when you do to be notified whenever I post another video. Thanks for your viewership, and y'all have a good day.